Okay, what's up guys? We have done a lot of work on this farm here. We are um, slowly adding to it as we get more seeds. I think I've actually run out of seeds to plant. Like, out of different unique seeds. We, um... We are missing quite a few, like... I thought it would have a lot. We have a lot, definitely, but we just don't have them all. So I'm gonna have to crossbreed. And just do that kind of stuff for a bit. So that, that won't be too annoying, but... The idea is just to have all these filled out, and then I want to build this big wall that goes along probably here and um then I'm gonna really focus my other stuff like uh, tech and magic I haven't really done much magic stuff so that'll be fun what's really good is um like as soon as these are, this is done it's just it's done forever like it's good I cannot stand making these things these crop sticks I think I've gone over, like, I've used over, like, 200 or something. Just in this alone. It sucks. So much. What else I've, I've also done? I've, like, I've cleared out this whole area. I want to maybe knock down this stuff. I really don't like this barge. I really want to redefine this room. I want to put my, uh, crop mutation shit right here. So that'll be nice. I also need better tools, better picks, all that crap. I need to get rid of these. Lots to do. But I just want to finish with the seed stuff first. Just so it's always there. Also, it looks like trash right now. Like, it looks great that there's a lot of growth and stuff. But the fact there's, like, water in between them. Ugh. That shit's so bad. I've still got this horse here. So I'm going to tame him as soon as we can. Aw. If he gets in there, hold up. I don't know how many villagers are in there. Oh, okay. My, uh, my bad. <laughs> my bad, guys. I'm not gonna kill him here, because too many clicks. But yeah, that's pretty much what I've been doing, what I've done. I'm not gonna get too much done later, later on, but mainly just want to get the seed stuff done. I just thought I would, like, check in, give you guys an update. I'm not sure how I'm gonna get all the other seeds. I'm gonna check what ones I don't have mainly going to use this. I'm just going to try to complete every quest I can. This horse is so loud. Try to complete every quest I can. Go up the tree. And just try to see what, 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 what kind of wall I hit. Like, I know I don't... I don't have... I don't have mustard seeds. I don't have... Like, a few of these I don't have. So when we finish that, that'll be good. I sort of really need this watering can. I looked at it, and this rune of water is kind of annoying because it takes the runic altar, which I'm not quite ready. I need a tin, the tin blocks, the main annoying part. I got the aluminium and stuff, but like I'd have to get mana infusion, then I have to get the coal plants. I don't even know the name of the coal plants, but as soon as we get them, then we can start doing that. I don't know if there's like a quest or something. Like, I was hoping there was a quest that give you, like, a, um, a water rune so you could actually build the bucket. But, from what I've seen, I don't think so. Yeah. Gonna do a lot of this, like, a lot of this seeding stuff. Oh, bit of lag. A lot of seeding stuff I'm gonna do off camera. It's just so boring to, to watch, in my opinion. Like, obviously, updates like this is good, because, like, you just see all the progression, so it looks great. But watching me go around and kill weeds and stuff, I don't even, I don't even want to edit that. It sounds terrible. But yeah, we're gonna eventually. I'm gonna build a new house soon too. I'm gonna probably use this big area and get rid of this, and I'll connect it to this. Yeah, a ton of ton of plans. It's mainly what I'm just talking about here. I did just upload the first two videos. They were. Horrible, because they were my first two videos. Very sorry if you watched them. Hope you're okay. Um, hopefully I can be better now. I don't know. It's been like a learning process. But, um... Yeah. That's all I really wanted to say. I'm going to try to get some more done before I sleep tonight. And... I'll, I'll 
see you when I see you. I guess. All right, what's up, guys? So um, we actually ran into our wall. It's like we've we tried to complete. We got all these done. Then we hit the cactus fruit. I did get some of my first video, but um, uh, I don't know. That not around anymore or something. Don't have them either. I also gonna need cactus, which I don't have yet. And I got this in a loot place, a loot bag. I don't really know. Like, I haven't done it yet, but. Whoa. So, can you actually build in here? I don't know how many blocks. I wonder, like, what this would be good for. Hmm. Maybe, like, a, um... Kind of works like an ender chest in one. Maybe this would be good for, like, some emergency chest stuff. So, like, whenever you're out and you might need something, or you might need to store a bunch of stuff. I don't know if you can place chests in here, but that, that sounds like a good idea for... But what is... How do you get back? Beautiful. So we're gonna get these cactus roots, and then I can continue on the quest chain and just keep going up, up, up. And that's gonna be the goal for right now. So once we get that done, I don't, I'm gonna wiki how to get what like what garden it is in, and then that'll be that'll be good. Uh, okay, so I'll check in later. Okay. So I'm back over here, and I think in there there's like an underground river or something, because there's just water flowing out of it, and it's like, it's like a very big hole, which is really cool. I'm actually heading back over the, um, to the area where I got the cactus root. Yeah. I also picked up rye, curry leaf, and, um, kiwi. Yeah. So those, those are the two new ones, which is really nice, because don't have to worry about them anymore. I still need, I know I need pineapple, I know I need some other bullshit. All right. That's, that's all I really wanted to show you, it was just that hole. Yeah, so I was like out exploring at hit night time. Obviously, like, my inventory just filling up and it's pretty dangerous. But I was able to just come into my key here and then um, just make a chest, put it, put everything in it. Now I can just go back out and come back later. So it's really good. Really, really good. So. I just want to say, like, Endermen in this mod pack are the scariest things in the actual game. Like, oh, did I just waste them? Fuck. Deal with them in a sec. Let's just make sure they don't. Okay. So I went out, got my cactus fruit seeds. I also got cucumber seeds and leek seeds. So that's really really good. Oh, yeah, I also got broccoli. And I think I got kiwi and the other one, which I already showed. So, that's, like, real good. We got, like, five of them, I think. Hopefully, I got, like, all the ones I need for right now. If not, I'll look into the mutations and stuff. But we'll go get those planted. Like, I think I have, like, seven new ones. So, that'll be good. Just want a quick, quick little update. So this is the first time it has ever rained. We're trying to get the cows here. We're trying to curb mutations for the seeds I don't have. We got sheeps. To actually um domesticate them, you have to breed them like over three times, I think, together. So like once. And I'm gonna so freaking this game. But I have to breed these two cows together, and then I have to breed those two cows together, then those two cows, and so on. 
then I can get milk from them. Same with the sheep. I can get wool. And I need to do chickens, but I couldn't, couldn't find any around here. But they should be easy enough. We're only missing, I'd say, about five seeds for the farm. But that shouldn't be too long. We'll get all that done. So, yeah. So, uh, just a little tip if you guys um want to put a bed in this room. Yeah, go ahead and don't. Because it works just like as if you're in the nether. It just instantly blows up. It's very lucky I'm alive. Ah. Yeah, don't do that. What the fuck? Is he going to have black wool? Oh, it ha look, it has little seconds on the right there. Wild sheep. That's cool. Hey guys, just a just a little tip. If you're um, you know, you have your own playthrough and you're kind of confused by these Sesame Street seeds, if you actually harvest them and you make the seed, you get Pam harvest seeds, and you want to have agriculture seeds, otherwise they won't they won't work. You can't plant them. So the only way to really get seeds is pretty much like that. And then you have to like, you have to spread them like that. You can't turn them into seeds like the rest of them. Just make sure like the best way to tell is just Pam's Harvest and then Agricraft. That's the main difference. It's a little, just a little glitch. It's not too bad. Like, uh, yeah. You can't place these ones because they're Pam's Harvest. But as soon as you get the sesame ones, I mean the Agricraft ones, you're, you're fine. That's all I want to say. So we converted to the black sheep, then we converted back to the white sheep. Is it still a wild sheep? Oh, feels bad. He's gonna make that difficult. Now, we have in fact finished the seed journey. Part one. So we've got all these seeds on the right. Obviously, there are way more seeds than that. So I got like all of those and then all of the um these are uh, seeds are just annoying to me and to farm so they won't be as like as a big scale as these i'm just glad i got these done now i can actually work on things that i care about rather than seeds but there's definitely something i wanted to just get done and out of the way we even got our industrial home i might even set up a little farm in front of the base for a bit until I can get some some windmills up and I'll need a coke oven for that so that will probably be what I do after I finish this that's just like what I'm gonna do and then as soon as um, all of I finish growing these these few last ones that I've got I'm gonna have to complete all these quests and I'm just about done with this I, I found the chickens so we'll get on that Hopefully I can get my water bucket soon. Yeah, we're gonna complete all this. Hopefully next time you see. And uh, yeah, it's gone good, boys. It's gone good. I don't know if you guys have uh, noticed this, but if you look around, you don't see any villages. Which is kind of scary. I know I, I've trapped one down, like, in a spot, but I'm going to need at least two unless I want to convert zombies. So I don't know if they're, like, hiding, but the city's, like, abandoned. It's because I, I'm not sleeping enough. Like, I'll let night go on for a few seconds and I guess zombies spawn and then they die and stuff. So I could have watched that a bit more. Guys, I'm gonna make the best item in the game. A backpack. These are really helpful, because you can... I didn't want to build these, th this one in particular, until I finished with um, the seeds. Otherwise, this backpack would have ended up being just filled with seeds. So that's why that happened. And probably right now, probably after I finish breeding, 
all these guys. I'm probably going to go um find some clay so I can get this coke oven going. And then when I get that going, then I can start working on these um industrial hemp. Like get my windmill or um water mill. And then uh, we'll, have, we'll have a source of power. And hopefully get my Tinker's thing back up. I just removed it because I don't want it here. And I don't know. There's no control on it. So might as well have it in my inventory. We finally have a normal cow. Alright guys. After doing this for many hours. We have finally completed them all. I'm going to complete fun claiming rewards and clicking on the loot boxes so that'll be interesting hopefully we get something good and what we're going to do with all these seeds in my inventory and in my chest we're just gonna Shall pretty much never talk about them again because that was horrible. But now we'll get a lot of shit from this. We'll be able to get a agricultural farming station. And I'm hoping to set up a windmill. I got my industrial thing, so I'm gonna set up a whole farm here and just until I get my um stuff. All the animals are pretty much done. I've just gotta go collect their stuff. I don't have enough coal for this. So that's that's a thing. I'm getting there though. Alright, after completing all the quests and getting all the loot bags, I've put them into all these chests. So we have calf claws. Diamond blocks nice. Rain muffler. Imagine it's just Oh, a Magnum torch. That's really good. We're gonna go ahead and put that down right now, actually. Got some nice stuff. Iron's nice. Keep me going for a bit. Two blocks of iron, too. Invar. Oh, coal. Okay, what else do we get? Some books. Put that on now. Later wood. Got some later wood here. Purple stained glass. Cool, dude. Move that aside. A lot of gold. Nothing really too good in this one. Oh, we got cinder pulse seeds. Never mind. That's, that's really good. That's really good. These are basically unlimited blaze powder. Oh, another magnum torch. How about that? We'll go ahead and put that one in the um the nether when we get there. Because fuck the nether. I shit plugs. Another diamond block. I'll be shot. TNT. That could be fun. A lot of pistons, I'm noticing. And this last one. This is the Evercroft case. This is pretty much guaranteed. You always get this. Yeah, that's about it. Oh, an Endurian block. That's good. Overall, I'm pretty happy with it. The two Magnum ones are really good. So yeah, these magnum torches, they pretty much stop anything from spawning. I think it's like a 62 each direction. And like 30 upwards. 32, 62 blots. Like this way, that way, that way, that way. Yeah, so these are really good. And I think they take quite a lot to make, too. That's not actually that bad. But this, we're so far from these, so... So far from that, so yeah, it's good for us right now. But so glad I got the Cinderpole seeds because they, yeah, they'll be good. All right, cool. So I was just exploring here, looking for um lava. There's a, there's a cow down here. Okay. I was just pointing down there, and there's actually, it's actually one of these, like a mob spawner. So that would be interesting. We'll 
probably make a farm out of that. And I know there is these quests all the way down here. We get the you kill like fifty of them, then you can get a mob spawner. So we're getting there on that, and then we'll be able to farm XP. So that'll be cool. So I found lava, but I hear one of these ice foot guys. Yeah, there he is. But I really, really need that lava. I'm gonna try from this angle. Looks like there's more lava down there. Okay. We did it, boys. Fuck you, dude. Later. There we go, actually. Okay, now it works. Now that we got this, we can do a lot with it. I really want to make a lumber axe so I can get a lot of wood. And I really want a pick that can mine past copper. Because this one just really isn't cutting it. If I want to go to the nether, I need obsidian. And I haven't gotten enough from these uh, all these loots. So we're going to have to do that. The, uh, the tedious way. Alright, what's up guys? I was able to get my obsidian pickaxe like just before I'm about to leave right now. So, that was good. You can now mine obsidian and shit. I learned that sheeps are really annoying. So I'm going to move them out. We got tons of ores. We're going to work on that stuff tomorrow. We're going to Really, um, you know, get some of these mining quests on. Because I really need to advance in that. Or I need to go magic. I need to pick one, though. Because all this farming stuff, yeah. This series, uh, will take a bit to become an actual thing, but right now it's looking pretty good. Like, I will continue to make episodes. I don't expect any views, but, um, it's still cool. It's still cool, like, publishing your stuff online and stuff. I find that really cool. And you guys can see what I've done, and I can have some kind of, I don't know, it's cool. But I really want to, I want to progress further, further. I'm going a bit too slow. Like we got the we got the farm done, so that's like that's good. I want to build a big wall, but I need a lumber axe for that. So we'll probably build a lumber axe, and the the materials on the lumber axe won't matter as much because it's it's an axe. You you don't need you know cobalt or whatever you want. You just need some strong durability ones, and then you're good. So hopefully we can get that one soon, and that will be like a permanent one for a very long time. And then what else could we need? Probably need a way better weapon. I've used this one since we started. I want a bow too, slime bow. Get that eventually. Yeah. Excavator. Oh yeah, yeah. I need um, I need a hammer, a really good hammer. I think that's a tough rod, yeah. So I did look, and there is a, um... There's a quest that gives a slime tough... Yeah. This gives a slime tough rod. These trees look really tempting, but... I'm gonna get the slime tough rod, because I don't know... I don't think you can actually make it in this mud pack. So it would probably be the only, um, slime tough rod you ever get. So I'll probably use it on like a first tier hammer. The hammer's not gonna last a whole whole lot of time until I get my new. Like I want to make a cobalt one with um, iodite, and that'll be good. But that'll be way when we get those seeds and we get those when we get to never and the never is less toxic because I 
hate the Neva. I've died countless amount of times though. And hoping in this series that I'm not going to die as much. Kind of just rambling at this point. I, 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 I gotta go to bed. So. Happy with this shit. Looking good. Sheep are annoying. Tink is up. What's that called? It's Coke up. And th this is taking way too long for me. I really... I don't know how to speed this up. Maybe put, like... I don't have the watering can, so I can't... Grow it. And every time they grow, I can't make a seed for it. So I have to, you know... Branch it out like, like that. Which is really annoying. But I really need more of these. Because I really want... A watermill. I mean, not a watermill, a windmill. I'll probably use uh, the water wheel until I get that, actually. So I can. I'm probably just going to set this up with like an agricraft farming station. Just have that do that. So that'll be, that'll be the plan there. Then I also want to move this room out. And I don't know. I got to figure out where I want, what I want to build here. And I need way more spruce trees. But if you if you're still around, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, I'm trying to talk more. Obviously, I'm completely a scrub at this kind of stuff. But if you still are like, if you're listening, what's up, dude? <laughs> okay, bye.